Hey everyone, it's April 1st and what does that mean? Yes, it is April Fool's Day, but no, that's not why today is important. Today is important because we have to fill out our 2020 census if we haven't already. And if you are like me and haven't received your mailer or you misplaced it, don't worry. You can still do a quick and fast um, submission of your 2020 census. I got mine done in less than five minutes. So make sure you go online and you put in your browser, which I'm going to start you off and then show you what the final result is going to say. You type in 2020census.gov for .gov. You go in, and it, this is your home page. It says, Shape Your Future, Start Here, and you're going to click on Respond Now. Once you click on Respond Now, you're going to see on your right-hand side, it says Start Questionnaire. You're going to click on that, and either you type in your 12-digit census ID that you got in the mail, but again, don't fret. If you didn't receive it, I had no problem going down here where it says you, if you do not have your census ID, click here. You click on that, and you add a series of questions, which include what state you're living in. You click on that. You go Next. You input your address, you click next, and then the questionnaire will start. It is very simple. Like I said, it took me less than five minutes, and then I got to, um, final, finally, it says, voila, I've completed my census 2020. And so there you have it. Make sure that you fill it out today, April 1st. Why? Because this is going to bring both federal funding resources to our communities, especially our public schools, our healthcare institutions, but also provide for a more fair, adequate representation by our political district maps. So make sure you go to again 2020census.gov and fill this out. If you have any questions, as always, feel free to reach out to us and let us know what those are.